now let's talk about the overall market right like what do we expect from the overall markets now well let's draw this in let's kind of zoom in here and see what happened today what happened today we gapped up today we pushed up into a key level of resistance what is that level of resistance on the spy it is the low 390s this area of resistance the low 390s we've talked about this level for a long time at your trading group and we also talked about it last night on our live stream so last night every sunday at 8 30 p.m eastern we go live where i go over with you my market outlook for the week what i think the market is going to do right the overall market the spot what do i think is going to take place and how i plan on making money from it last night's live stream i gave you a very specific analysis i told you that i believed that the market was going to push up into the low 390s and then stall went out of steam and then pull back it's exactly what happened here today i have a quick little video clip showing this analysis from yesterday's live stream again this is from last night's live stream when i was going over what i expect the market to do this week let's go ahead right now guys and play that clip so let's get back to the game plan for the week what i'm looking for here is for the markets to try to push up into this level right try to push up into this zone this area of resistance push into it and then just stall push into it stall and like kind of just pull back a little bit so i expect to see something that looks like this like i literally expect to see candles that look maybe something like this like that monday tuesday wednesday and then thursday And then Thursday. So there you guys have it. So there's the analysis from last night's live stream where I told you guys I expect us to push up into the low 390s, run out of steam, stall, and then give you a bit of a pullback. Well, let's go ahead. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at that. So if we go to the intraday chart from today, okay, let's go to the intraday chart from today. I'll zoom in. Okay, and here was that level, right? The low 390s. You really, really got deep into it. You can see we kind of popped our head above. And I'll go back to the daily chart so you can see it. So here's that level, right? Here's the level on daily chart. This is the daily chart. So you guys can all see this area, right? This is the, this is the daily chart, okay? This whole area, the low 390s, right? This whole entire area is what we're looking at. So that's that level, right? You all see that level now, right? Everyone can, can see it, the low 390s. Right, which is why on the live stream last night, I said, look for us to push into the low 390s and then run out of steam, reverse, and then pull back. Well, let's go to the intraday chart. And what did we do today? What did, oops, I didn't mean to do that. What did we do today? Well, we pushed right up into those low 390s early. We got higher than I thought. I didn't think we were going to get to 393.50. I thought we were going to stop around 392.50. So I was off by a dollar. You know, I actually said 392. I think even in yesterday's live stream, I said 392. 393.50. We got to 393.50. So it was a dollar off on where the market was going to kind of top itself out. But then look what happened. We got, we tired out and the market just rolled over and, and pulled back all afternoon. And members of, I mean, I was busy working on some private mentorship stuff, but Geo, one of our moderators in training who trades the spy specifically, trades option on the spy each and every single day, crushed put options on the SPY late in the afternoon. In the back of that analysis, and a lot of members were able to capitalize on that as well. So it's not just myself in two trading, you guys. There are nine professional traders that are all trading with you during the day. They're all sharing their screen. They're on the microphone talking to you. They're answering questions or giving you their commentary and analysis throughout the day. It's not just myself. We're not just also just gone after an hour or two. You guys were with you from open to close, actually from pre-market, we're with you until close. So congratulations again, members in TTG that were able to capitalize on the afternoon short. That's what we talked about, the afternoon short, right? That was the whole event. afternoon. Look for shorts in the afternoon. A lot of people capitalize on it. We had the longs in the morning with the Tesla trade and then the shorts in the afternoon. I didn't, I didn't take shorts in the afternoon, but other members did, other moderators did. It was an absolute fantastic trade. So congratulations again on a great day, a great day inside of chat.